Hi there, welcome along. My name's Dan, and you are watching Dan's Metal and Rock channel. Now, if you'd have seen one of my shorts that I uploaded recently, I've done a short about Metallica, Death Magnetic. Now, this is an album I'm not familiar with. Um, my fiance, she kind of convinced me to do this on my channel because she likes this album a lot. Uh, one of her favourite songs of Metallica is on this. So I, I said I would listen to it with an open mind because I'm an old school Metallica guy. I'm like, I don't really like anything after the Black Album, really. I mean, the Black Album was a bit of a a low point, but at least it had some good stuff on it. But uh, uh, but the other stuff, uh, like Load and Reload and, and uh, <laughs> some Anger, <laughs> um, I'm not on board with that stuff. So, but anyway, I, I've given it a listen. And with an open mind, I've listened to it four or five times. And I've got a bit of a a bit of a gripe to start off with. They've released this on CD, right? Obviously. And you go into the CD cover, and the order of the songs on the back is not the order that the book's in. All the songs in the book are the wrong way round. So if you're looking for lyrics, and you think, hang on a minute, where's that? And you've got to go searching through the book pit. Not a good idea, don't like that. Rant over. So anyway, the actual songs on the album. Now, I took a few notes on these. Not too detailed or anything. I just took a few notes. And, um, well, what can I say? The first song... That was Just Your Life. Um, fast and aggressive. Pretty good Metallica, you know. A good solo. And um, a good fast riff, that's what I put. I mean, quite a good song. The end of the line. Not sure about the riff on this one. Very commercial. Um, a good Wah Wah solo, though, from Kirk Hammett. I like that. His work on this... As it is on most things that he does. Um, I checked out his solo record uh, the other week. Fantastic. The guy is just awesome. But yeah, you know, good breakdown and a nice bass sound. Now then, they've got a bass sound on this album. Maybe they should have thought about that on And Justice For All. Hey Lars, hey James. You know what I mean? But anyway, yeah, so um, the next song was Broken, Beaten, Scarred. I'll put here, not bad, but not good either. Just a run-of-the-mill thing, I think. Uh, the Day That Never Comes, which is, I gather, was the single. Uh, a good mellow start. Very commercial, but not bad, you know, pretty good song. Uh, love is a four-letter word, apparently. And it keeps repeating that. And repeating that. Do love is a four-letter word. Uh, but anyway, not a bad song. All Nightmare Long. Now, this is... my fiancé's favourite track on here. Um, it's a great riff. And... Good chorus, and it's good Metallica riff, good Metallica song. It goes on for too long, but I'll say it's called All Nightmare Long. It is too long. But I do agree with the missus. It is probably the best song on here. Um, it's crafted well. It's done well. The lyrics are good. Um, so, yeah. Uh, there's a song on here called Cyanide, which is good, 
great riff, good breakdown, good guitar work from Hammett again. That guy is just great. The Unforgiven Free. Now then, do we really need this? Do we really need to do a song three times? They've done it on the Black Album. Phenomenal song, don't get me wrong. Very good. But to do it three times? I'm not sure. Nice piano start though, I suppose. A bit of orchestral work at the start. Yeah, I like that, you know. But um, kind of made for the S&M thing, I think. Or the orchestra and that, yeah. So. Uh, the Judas Kiss is okay. Suicidal Redemption's okay. Uh, my Apocalypse is pretty good. Quite a good Metallica tune. So overall, um, I will say that it's a good album. But this is Metallica and it's one of them things. Like I said, I said on my Iron Maiden review, if it was anybody else that made this album, we'd be like, wow, this is fucking brilliant. But because it's Metallica, and they wrote the stuff that they have early on, then, um, like, you know, we expect them to, every time, just produce God, you know? But they haven't done it for the past few years, put it that way. But, uh, yeah, so, so my opinion on it is it's not a bad album. It's not a good album, but it's not a bad it's not a bad album. They've got some good songs on here, but it just doesn't cut it for me, especially when it comes to Metallica. So, so that's the video. If you like what you see on this video, press subscribe, and I'll see you soon, guys. Thank you. See you soon.